given that. Line the first cut for Zach. 124, good angle. He's pretty handy with a wedge. I should say, <laughs> tap in birdie. Gotta love that. Yeah, that is a great way to start this championship for Zach. That needs a little bit of a break. One fifty seven is the number. And that is on a very aggressive line. Yeah. In the hand here, two twenty three is the number. That one is pin seeking Lovely. if it's the right distance. And it is. And that's why he's a he's 11th in the FedEx Cup. Johnson's tee shot on the way, Mark, at 13. Driver and that one ripped down the right center, and I can't. Well, actually, we're staying here. Zach Johnson, we can't miss a shot of Zach Johnson. Not the way he's going. This lower flooded just right of the flag. Beautiful control of the spin there. I feel like it may just want to fall off slightly as it runs out of speed. This thing, Zach says, is really hot, and that is picture perfect. Perfect lie, receptive green. Look out. <laughs> Zach Johnson's putts on the way, disappointing stroke for him. He's also. Shouldn't be a problem. Well, nothing's a problem when you hit it that straight. That thing is splitting the fairway. That's safely out to the middle of the green, though. Green from outside of 40 feet. This 15th green swings quite a bit from Zach's right to left. And look at, oh, oh, perfect speed. That one higher in the air on a really nice line. He is smiling. <laughs> Over his right shoulder. <laughs> that one will be just dandy. It just looks like it's on autopilot. I would try and favor the left side. The more this ball moves to the right, the better uh, the angle. You better scoot. Sit, sit. 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 I think gravity is going to win sit. this battle. I just see it creeping back down gravity the hill. That's always exactly wins. Yeah, what we were just talking about, weren't we? Yeah, that was a bit of a miss. It I think all on the heels of that awkward lie he drew there and that ball now is going to leave Zach Johnson with a tough putt for a birdie. It's breaking back to the left hand side. And so that right break that Mark just talked about. And that's going to be just perfect. The pitch mark is kicked up and actually got in the way of his backswing a little bit. That's from 192 there. No problems. Not at all. So Zach now with a... He's four under and putting well. I like his chances. Zach Johnson, his second shot at his 10th hole of the day. Mark. A little bit. Beautiful oh, a little angle. Bit. Zach's thinking birdie. Another one right out of the blueprint. Just curls that over the edge of the bunker that Mark was talking about. But you may as well strike when that iron is hot. Well, look dead no. center. It's got to go a little bit to catch the green. No. 
That should kick it a little bit to the left. Man, he's a wizard with that wedge, isn't he? Good. To get to five under. So that pierces wind will. Go. 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 A little miss, it's got to go. 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 I mean, that's the key to, to, to playing great golf is where do your misses go? And, and you know, Zach hand off the club and was very verbal about where went and he's still got to have a birdie putt. So it's going to be a long one, but. But once it crests the slope, it turns down the hill. You've got to be careful. Let's watch this. So you're looking, do I take it right of the, the, the tree and draw it over there, or do I play it left and try to hit a little fade? Zach is a, a right to left player, and so he's going to take it between the right side of the. Uh. He's done pretty okay. nicely. Man, the screen looks like it falls away from you beyond the cup. It would put you in a pretty good frame of mind for the rest of the week. Oh. Reaching with this club, Zach can just line that up and swing away. Needs a break down the right. Yeah. Zach Johnson now with his second. Get up. Get up. That was a horrendous right. lie in, inside of about two feet. Little defensive there, but not bad. That's Zach's five wood. Should be just fine. That was just ho hum, another fairway. 118 yards, 112 covers the bunker, but that one's a little pulled. And these putts will tend to want to roll out a bit more. Right to left. You should be good. Go well, ahead. this one Go looks ahead. really handy. Right at it. Zach Johnson. It really gets in the player's periphery quite easily. Meanwhile, Zach Johnson is laying sprinklers on his tee shots today. They're so accurate. He's <laughs> in danger of coming back to the front of the green. Hang in there. Hang in there. Go. I think you've got to give this one some speed to hold this line. It's got Just the like speed that. and the line. Final tee shot of the day for Zach Johnson. He has been like an assassin with this club the entire day. Once again, splits the fairway. Also beyond the flag on a direct line. So that a lower flighted one from Zach needs to get lucky. Zach Johnson taps in. This will be for a beautiful 65 start. So I guess that's 38 rounds in a row, going back nine years to the last time that he has shot over par here.